Hello everyone. So today is the 2nd of January and on my uh, challenge, as you all may know, um, every I'm looking up the national um, days for each day and seeing which one I can do. Today is National Sci-Fi Day, so I like that would be kind of cool, or science fiction, National Science Fiction Day. So, in honor of science fiction, here you go, how about a time machine? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I thought I would look around here and see what kind of science fiction things we got going on. Um, of course, like I said, uh, definitely a time machine would be... Doctor Who probably has a lot of uh, science fiction in it. Uh, what else we got here? We have Robocop. That would be kind of science fiction. And, of course, we have Back to the Future. And... We've got uh, Ghostbusters, which is kind of science fiction, uh, how they go out about getting ghosts. Um, Transformers is science fiction, you know, the whole idea of cars turning into droids. <clears throat> but yeah, um, so there's some definitely science fiction stuff in here. I am definitely a nerd, so I'm okay with that. See if I got any books that are science fiction. I don't think I have anything that... I mean, I've got comic books that definitely have some science fiction in it. From Iron Man. You know, the uh, a guy with the ability to uh, create his own suit. Um, Captain America would be science fiction. Spider-Man would definitely be science fiction. Uh, probably Superman, all the superheroes, they would probably be science fiction enough. Um, I have comic books, but I don't have them out. I more or less collect them. I don't really... My days of reading them are kind of over. But, uh, yeah. Uh, we have Christine. That's kind of a science fiction in a way. Car Coming to Life. That might be more of a fantasy. I don't know. Or horror. Just straight up horror trying to think if any Stephen King books were science fiction, but I don't think so. They're more or less just horror. But anyway, uh, yeah, Jurassic Park, uh, you name it. I, myself, tonight, although YouTube, YouTube will probably, uh, I'll get in trouble on YouTube if I show it, but I know for tonight, for me... Since I mentioned Jurassic Park, that is one of my favorite science fiction movies. So, um, even though I'm not really on that particular day. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, watch Jurassic Park tonight. That's one of my all-time faves. Uh, but yeah, there's also Back to the Future... Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to watch Back to the Future tonight. But anyway, I'm definitely going to make it a sci-fi night. Probably watch uh, Jurassic Park and Back to the Future before I go to bed. Because uh, i got a little bit of time before I'm going to go. So, um, and relax. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be my way of, of making my sci-fi night. So, challenge accepted on that see here yeah. all right so even though i can't really play these on my channel without getting in uh trouble i don't want to do that here's some ideas of some really good some of these are really good sci-fi some of them i don't know if you really count them as good but they're here anyway uh this is just an example these are on paramount um Netflix, Disney, all of that. They've got sci-fi. They've got different ones that you can choose from as well. These are high energy. I'm trying to go down, but I think that's all I... It's saying that's all I got. You know what? Almost tempted to wash the time machine. 
<laughs> since I just mentioned it. Mentioned time machines a while ago. Ugh. But yeah, there's your different ones. Since I mentioned Transformers, though, I'm probably going to watch Transformers. There's Interstellar. You know what? I'm going to watch Interstellar. That's one of my favorites when it comes to sci-fi. I do like Transformers. I do like the, some of the superhero movies. Star Trek isn't too bad. Uh, World of, War of the Worlds, that one's a really good one. Terminator, of course. You can't go wrong with Terminator. Um... If they had RoboCop, that'd be freaking awesome. I don't know how Ninja Turtles falls into sci-fi. I guess somewhat because of Donatello, but... Well, I guess in how they're created. I guess that would be sci-fi. Uh, just because there's, there's uh, a line that sometimes people cross where it's between fantasy and sci-fi. I guess Ninja Turtles just crosses that line enough where it's more sci-fi than it is fantasy. But there you go. Um, like I said, I think my movie for tonight, though, is Interstellar. That's one of my favorites. I'm going to go with it for tonight. And enjoy. That is going to be my choice. Whoa, sorry about the hand. That's going to be my movie of choice for tonight. Also, coming up soon next week, which is why this poster right here is behind me. We're going to make it, my girlfriend and I are going to make a labyrinth slash, uh, I think that's going to be this weekend. But that's coming up, a labyrinth slash Elvis um, uh weekend because David Bowie's birthday and Elvis's birthday happen to be on the same day. At least that's what Google tells me. So we are going to make, uh, of course, I think their birthdays are when we are working. So we are going to be watching their movies this weekend. So that way we can kind of watch them together since especially the labyrinth happens to be one of our favorites. So I might get in trouble by the girlfriend. Uh, watching that one by myself <laughs> since I kind of got her hooked into it. But uh, starting uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, is Tolkien's birthday. So in honor of that, I'll be starting the uh, um, Frodo Baggins and you know, the Lord of the Rings. I'll be starting to watch that movie. And I'll probably talk about that a little bit more to, on tomorrow's episode. So I'm kind of already giving stuff away. Um, I know there's other national days on there. So be sure to look and see what other national day I throw in there. Because I think I am going to throw in another one. While uh, besides that, um, Today, today is also uh, National Strawberry Drink Day, and I was going to do something like that along with this, uh, with Sci-Fi Day. But I don't have any strawberry drink mix here at the house, and I really don't feel like going out and getting some. So um, I'm kind of relaxed, and it feels nice in here versus the cold air out there. So this is where I'm at. But uh, yeah, I'm going to watch my movie. And I uh, will catch you guys on the next video. Hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.